Catching your own bait certainly can be a lot of fun and most of the places around the country in the beach vicinity you're catching what we call pippies, yugaries, or in the southern states, cockles. When you're down on the beach, some beaches will have a lot of these black rocks around the place. That's not the ideal place to be. You want to find a nice piece of clean sand and then do the pippy shuffle. Let's go and have a look. This is great fun for the kids. With a twist of your hips, you put your feet together and start shuffling into the sand. As the water goes out, you'll feel them squirming under your feet. If you don't catch any, just move to the left or right a little. Also, look for other people doing it. Generally, a lot of pippias will move together. Also, look for shells washed up on the high tide mark. That's a good telltale sign. And also, try looking for pippy birds. Besides having some fun, it kind of keeps you fit. There we have it, a lot of fun catching these little babies, but nonetheless you can eat them as well. In fact, a quick tip for you within this tip is to put them in some fresh seawater while they're still alive for about several hours and they'll disperse all of the sand out of that sack inside and then you can chew on them or cook them up first if you like. But of course, great for frozen uh, baits, so you can go next time you go out there, just pull them out of the bag, they're nice and fresh still. Uh, or of course, just use them as you go. But there are size limits, bag limits, and of course, season closure. So check whatever state you're in, for your local laws. Nice.